dry cleaning. Dry cleaning and the set of actions to remove solid particles, such as dust from surfaces, generally without the help of water or chemicals. Dry cleaning can be done on floors, walls, ceilings and furniture equipment, and many other types of surfaces. This type of cleaning is always indicated in the preparation of surfaces or floors for deeper cleaning actions, such as wax removal, washing, or polishing, among others. After all, cleaning actions start by removing dust and other solid particles. Another indication of dry cleaning is the maintenance or conservation of actions already carried out in order to prolong the cleaning that has already been done. In the case of floors waterproofed with waxes or resins, another goal is to increase the useful life of these finishes because the friction generated between small particles and the traffic of footwear on floors is diminished drastically. With these actions, the level of hygiene of the environments is also improved since dust is a fertile medium for microorganism proliferation and is responsible for most allergic and respiratory diseases. The NR32 is a set of regulatory standards that guide various procedures in environments where health services are provided, such as hospitals, clinics, ambulatories, among others. It prohibits the sweeping of floors to prevent particles from being suspended and recontaminating people and equipment. Common brooms remove from the environment only the larger particles that cause a very dangerous effect to human health by suspending the smallest particles that are the most harmful to health and to real estate equipment. The Brolympia MAPA systems collect dust and other particles from floors and walls without allowing them to be suspended and contaminate environments. The sets are formed by the aluminum cables with handle frame to fix the refills and the refills produced with different organic and synthetic materials, each indicated for specific situations of use. Refills are provided and produced according to the type of environment that will be cleaned. Refills with greater amount of synthetic fiber in its composition produce static with friction in the floor and are charged electrically. This small charge causes the soils to be attracted and collected with greater efficiency. Refills with more closed frames, for example, allow extremely small particles to be collected. In addition to these synthetic models, Brolympia provides pure cotton refills indicated for the more routine cleaning actions. The length of the refill is an important item to optimize the productivity. Larger environments require larger sets. Choose the ideal type of MAPE for the task you will perform and get the maximum performance that Brolympia equipments provide. Ergonomics Brolympia MAPA systems provide perfect ergonomics due to a 1.40 meter rod that allows the operator to perform work without overloading the spine, increasing productivity and improving quality of life at work. Special emphasis for the prevention of WMSD, work-related musculoskeletal disorders that represent the major causes of work leave or absenteeism. How to use the Brolympia Dust Mop. Position the functional cart near the entrance of the environment that will be cleaned. Initiate mopping by the point farthest from the entrance to bring dirt close to the functional cart, exit or waste disposal site. Application of MAPA must keep the particles and dirt always in front of the refill. And the movements must be made in the form of an eight. The hand that lies further down the cable is the one that rotates the equipment to facilitate dust collection and the displacement of the operator.
cleaning can be done with the operator moving forward or with operator moving backwards. Finishing dry cleaning. When approaching the functional cart or the disposal site, do not shake the mop to prevent the particles from being suspended again. Use the spade with tilting cover to collect the particles. The Brawlympia mop system for dust can be used in hospital or laboratory environments. For displacement of equipment in these environments where cleaning is a critical factor, you can use a cap to protect the refill. Can dust mops be used on walls? Yes. The correct sequence for cleaning indoor environments is A. Ceiling B. Walls C. Floors There are mops suitable for ceiling and wall cleaning. There are specific models for this action with smaller format, but with the same efficiency of the others. The procedures for dry cleaning of walls are like those for cleaning floors. Always start cleaning the walls at the highest point and far from the entrance, and clean them horizontally. Conservation and cleaning of the refill. When the refill is very impregnated with dirt, wash it with cold water and mild detergent. Avoid washing the refill in a washing machine. Put it to dry in a ventilated and shaded environment to avoid deformation of the fibers. Electrostatic Duster. Through static, this duster removes the dust without spreading it by the environment preventing diseases and damages to facilities and equipment. Great for cleaning furniture, computers, blinds, and other surfaces where dust is deposited. Washable. It has excellent durability and does not lose its cleaning ability. Its glove is made with 100% acrylic yarns that remove and collect the dust, so you discard it in a safe place. How to use the Brawlympia Electrostatic Duster? Spray the duster evenly on all surfaces of furniture, fixtures, and walls. Mechanical Hand An equipment that allows the operator to collect solid waste such as gases and bandages. Cutting punch and materials for recycling or safe disposal as it prevents injury and contamination of hands. Roto Twister For the first action of solid particles indoors, one can use the twister squeegee with hinged cable and soft and uniform rubber blade allowing for the collection of waste leaving them together to be collected with a Brawlympia spade. Static Paper Static Paper is an efficient system that provides high levels of security in the cleaning of floors and walls. Through a sheet of non-woven material coupled to a rubber base that produces homogeneous pressure on the surfaces, the static paper system prevents contamination of the operators and between environments. After use, the blades are easily disposed in safe places.